Hi there and welcome back, dear friends and deep thinkers. There's only one wall left. That's the main thing here. The rest is that we want to connect everything with gateways now, as we have three parts of the Empire, so that's a must-have. We want to complete our galactic wonders, the art installation and the science nexus. And uh, yeah, we, we want to have... And we have superfluous influence, we'll use that for resource habitats, for exotic goods. Because that's the main thing to get there, is exotic goods. It's doing relatively good, but once we are upgrading and integrating all these new planets, there'll be, there'll be a shortage of that, especially when we, when we start upgrading like all research facilities and all like things like that and there's you can see here we need to expand this transport fleets and stuff by a lot so we'll just recruit some armies here quickly no, we're recruiting here already we'll get some from mars as well let's see and we can only go for Dream Warrior armies. The others are too weak at this point. Strong Bernathi here will are the point. For that we need to acquire some more minerals. They are extremely costly at the moment, but what can you do? Let's see, Brachirians, Vakdigi. We have more strong Benathi here. We can also go for the Uber Assisians. They're also doing very well. Another three from that. And then we can uh, attack the Fallen Empire. We'll have to constantly build these and expand our mining facilities. Otherwise, we will not get this going. It's even thinkable once we have enough um, enough unity again that we will choose to go for um, where was that omnifarious acquisition to get a little bit more minerals because it's so important right now. As you can see, the Marefians are working on removing these fleets, but they're struggling a bit. And we definitely want to help with that. So let's just have a look where our fleets are. We still want to leave the force of reason in terminal egress. It's like just a, like a guardian of terminal egress. It, the terminal egress is an advantage, but it's also it's also dangerous um, to have because you need to defend it. Now, we need to go as close to Duras Caden as possible. But not exactly there, I think, because, yeah. We might just... We might just have problems here, let's see. Yeah, we might not have problems. Let's just order everyone to Duras Caden. Thieven Edward... We're still working on the naval capacity. We'll not expand that for now, but our big uh, undefeatable privateers party is also coming. That's going to be good as well. So here we go. Faction founded the Silver Guard. Hard, pushing hard to assert our military dominance over the rest of the galaxy. So our um, people have been expanding here. Uh, there's the groggy black holes here that the, I'm kind of, I sh I'm sure they they should stay here at the moment. I'm really not keen on wait. having the groggy black holes move so far away from this. But the dragons, I think, um, need to move. Oh, come on now. We don't need you. We don't need you. And we don't need the Dreadnought. Uh, oh well, the Dreadnought could, I, th I think, move along with the Dragons to the Sun System. So we have another guard here again. A pirate guard, if you so want. Look, the Merefians are coming back. It's all good. 
Now we need to manage our gains. Ship in Metis. We should send it somewhere it can do something here. In Aegis, for example. Um, yeah. Whoop. And there's some new open spots here. We've sent some fleets out that will uh, go and look for things to investigate. I hope they can do that. Omnifair's acquisition is the thing we're waiting for. Look, Force of Reason has been repaired. New technology, technology discovered. Which means we will again... I mean, it is a self-healing fleet, but still we want to position it like here. And now we can to also change a little bit what we're researching. So we want to get more into uh, economy again. Like planetary build speed, there's a big bonus on that. And it definitely helps. So send someone in here. Have that going. Corona. Corona. Gonna research there. Receiving transmission. Oh, nice. Uh, who wants a transmission? The MAGA Commerce Link. Are they on? They are... They want a migration treaty. Do we want MAGAs? I don't know. The thing is, it will cost us influence, so... We don't want to invest into that at the moment. They're relatively friendly, but... There will be enemies before long, and then it might be a problem. The new Andigoni Carnet has been destroyed by its enemies. <laughs> Who's done that? The Southern Dianuia. Yeah, they're taking back their stuff. It was to be expected. That was a very short mid-game crisis. The mid-game is also long over. Endgame is coming. Endgame. Which means what we need is way, way, way more research. So that will be the next step. The Science Nexus research wings. We can somehow afford that. New technology discovered. And... Yeah, that was a good one. Administrative capacity. We definitely need help in that. Starbase capacity will also help. 169. 194. Go for that. Ah, oh, we're losing stuff here. Let's have someone take this for us because we want to get to the maximum level. To get more research speed during an in-game crisis. That's going to be probably important one day. Ooh, <laughs> the minerals. Ah, the, 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 the end is in their association status. With us. Well, that's not good. <laughs> you can see that the next war is already coming. Which means we're currently managing peace economy so we can uh, expand very quick well there's a fleet here Oop. what kind of fleet is that the regulators pirate fleet why well, has no one removed that so far I don't know. the fleets are gathering here that's fine look at this uh, the minerals we need. It's crazy. The consumer goods. But what is surely what is going on with the minerals? How much do we need? We we need to activate that and get like 180 a month. 
That's weird. It's weird. There are weird things happening there. What is... What is getting on there? And the thing is, through the war we can also not... Um, change our Hostile styles. fleet within range. There's your party short fleet, but that's just laughable. That's just... Who is that guy? Your party. Great. But are they even very the strong? Scanned. No. No, you got something scanned in Hazy. Nice. New technology discovered. Good, good. Shield harmonics. Um, it was very good to research while fighting. Now we'll get into energy credits again. New technology discovered. We're here in half the run. Is there anything else left? We have to move over this, okay, then we can try to get in here, and here, and here, and here, and here, and here. And there's a pirate fleet here, that's not gonna disturb us. Do we have stormfire cannons now? Ah, we, ha we have the autonomous ship intellect, again, I think. <laughs> <laughs> just cannot use them. Why can't we use them? Because they are reserved for hive mines. Hive mines. Powder kegs are here. What's going on here? Mm. Let's get into that, right? Also, let's get into a hundred. Transport fleet's been fully repaired. You all need to merge your fleets. Unity, yes, Omnifarious Acquisition. It's, it's the right time for this now. I hope this will change a bit, yes. Um, means we can cancel that trade. Big Esmeralda at level 9 now. She's she's so experienced. Getting our realm through everything. Huh? We can now. Let's just have a look at the edicts we can go for. Mega structure build speed. That would also have been good. Well, let's just start it now. Engaging hostile station. Oh, we're already at the Rebellion Vortex. Oh, that's nice. Uh, we'll go to Baldoon. There's a fleet of the Yapati Shard still. I don't know. We'll just fly through here, there and try to wreck things, but... We cannot really access stuff with this fleet, so we'll have to go there and then here to free that. Only the privateer's party can access these big fleets. This is still blinking. I wonder why that is all blinking here. Dolores. Hostiles. Spring. What is that? Care Mega Warform. What is, what is going on in this world? And the independent care nation. What is, what is that? A relic world with mad war forms on them? Huh. Now we have fleets from the. Fuck <laughs> you, They are going to our planets now. Alright, oh, that's interesting. 
Um, do we have a fleet here now? Yeah, we have the bolsterous buccaneers. Mm, 400 days. Four hundred days. They are probably quicker in the end. The Bucky's here. Uh, I will try just try to get in there. It'll be the better choice. Everyone is flying away, evading hostiles. I hope they can. Station do that. under attack. The lesser stations under attack, of course, going down quickly. Planetary build speed. That's a nice thing to get. Uh, what would be next? Next good thing. Defense platforms. Get back to Corona. Let's see what it well does here. Right, just what we need, an invasion. Another invasion Space after everything had been over. They're flying through with their little terrible fleets. New technology discovered. They're troubling us. Interstellar expansion. Starbase capacity plus one. We definitely like that. Um, leader lifespan could be a good thing to have. As leaders start dying, we, we'd like to get things to not dying. Oh, I think our specialist for that died. Yeah, that's kind of ironic, right? That's that. Twice hang care. Huh? Be a good replacement officer. Mm. That's crazy. <laughs> A psionic robot scientist of the Evoken, I mean, of the Evoken. Okay. Mm. Leading society. I have to go for Baldassari. Yeah. That's kind of good too. We're getting things moving again. Finally, the privatist party is here. We'll send it to the borders. What are they doing? Hostile fleet within range. Ethos system. So diverse. But we have a guard here, so we don't have to be worried at that point. And we have a guard at the L cluster. And now we'll get in with the destroyer fleet. The literal destroyer fleet, uh, not the, the ship class destroyers. They should be able to destroy everything. There's another fleet of the Yapati Shard. What? They're taking on the Bilnok Hive. Of course, the Bilnok Hive is, is in a bad position to fight that. Space Storm Ragla arrives. Massive subspace disturbances have erupted in systems across the galaxy. Early reports indicate that nearly 50% of the systems in the galaxy have been affected by this unprecedented phenomenon, which appears to be a byproduct of thousands of years of heavy hyperspace travel by civilizations both past and present. Scientists are confident that this galactic space storm will dissipate by itself within a period of 5 to 10 years. Till that happens, the storm will play havoc with sublight engines, shield generators, and sensor systems in those star systems affected by it. The galactic community has officially named this storm Ragla, and uh, issued a general travel advisory. This too shall pass. I think um, sometimes shields 
uh, are missing then, which is not tragic in itself. Uh, let's take that on first, so we get a first step in there. Of course, that's all happening at once now. Mm, great stuff. Governor in the Pterect sector. We will rename that stuff at one point. It's, it's really terrible. You can you reunite with an armchair commander. What's going on here? Yeah, private his body got it. Mm. Destroyed stuff. Now it's time to get to Obilea, I think. Or are they already flying to Obilea? They're flying to Mias. We'll fly to Obilea. Spaceport under attack. Alpha Centauri. <sighs> Alpha Centauri, what's going on here? You guys, fly over and clear Alpha Centauri, will ya? New technology Get discovered. Away. Get away! Retreat! 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 Go leaf! Uh, Starfarin Charlie has died. Uh, yeah, that's why we need better stuff. Uh, where was Twice Hang Pierre now? And where's Beruta? Beruta's here? Okay. And we'll just fly here to Supes. Both of these. Good new twice hang Pierre here. Research. Yes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I see. There's no shields here. Look, the Juggernaut is also coming in. Ooh. We have lost quite a few destroyers here. Five destroyers, one cruiser. We have to remodel that. battleships. Debris scanned. And I have to say it's very cool that the storm has so many effects right now. Look, it has shield notification, which could also have helped us there. Something analyzed in Arrakis. There's something to analyze here. That would be extremely interesting. We have to we have to send someone in there. Someone expendable. <laughs> Maybe crazy as Meralda. Yeah, she's not that bad, but she's also not that good. So we'll send her in here. As quickly as we can. I have to recover here with that. Oh yeah. Physics research. I don't even know what we got there, but energy credits is still good. So, pirate fleet in Alpha Centauri, yeah, yeah, yeah. But there's something coming in to save that. All the dragons in the house. There's also the question, can we finally build a dragon? Mm. Yeah, we still need living metal. I don't even really know yet how to access this. Hostile fleet within range. A party shard to the Hithara system. Ah, okay. Oh well, I'm not worried about that so much. Mm. Fly over to Zero, maybe. Enough time to repair there. What about Procyon? You've flown over. You can fly back now. There's also another... Um, piece here you could 
Help research the holiday planet. Thirteenth star order in the Thalassa system. Yeah. Research project and finally coming over. Where are the fleets? Ah, here. Powder kegs. Asset acquired. Oh, we have secured access to an official within the Sririan civic hierarchy. Nice. So we have two assets. Prepare sleeper cells. Uh, subterfuge government. What does sleeper cells need? Subterfuge government. Subterfuge government. Oh, we could acquire more assets <laughs> through our assets. Launch that. It's getting on there. Ah, now here. Okay, good. Ninety-eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna be here quickly. 103k, whoa, <laughs> that's gonna be something. I hope we can take that on. Hostile fleet within range. They're coming here? Well, I don't care. Silver Gene leveled up. Nice. Engaging hostile fleet. Science ship in the surpass system. Uh, do we have anything to research? Not right here. They're, they're <laughs> flying all around here. What's going on with that? Uh, surpass, surpass, surpass. Um, Yeah, it's to the point where you don't know where they're even coming from. We'll send you to Oceanus. Yeah, hopefully we can laser this down quickly. Whoa, what's going on there? Debris scanned. That's... That's another level. We have to be more careful in the future. I mean, we took this, but at what price did we take this? That's <laughs> insanity. <laughs> That's insanity. Absolute insanity. <sighs> Need to take this back. Debris in Asmo. Giga Cannon. Everything here. Sweet. Uh, groggy black holes are at the thing. I destroyed an escort. Wow, we did that. <laughs> Two cruisers, nine destroyers, three battleships. That's been a costly thing. Oh, we're just going to sit here now for a while to control that system. And then we can research here soon Debris hopefully scanned. and here as well and this crazy esmeralda getting more something's happened uh, spotters have begun ingratiating themselves with targets we've marked as potentially useful acknowledged good stuff uh, here now we need to be a little bit more careful i think 
What's going on here with the powder cakes now? Where are we? Ah! We have arrived here. Okay, good. I hope this will be enough. I mean, there are no shields here, which is both an advantage and a disadvantage. We're getting reinforcements, lost. which is good. Fleet lost. Oh, good. The station, yeah, they wanted to reintegrate. Wow, what a... <sighs> These guys are opponents if there's ever been some. <laughs> it was too many. <laughs> 22 corvettes. They just lost two escorts. Uh, let's see here. Strike craft damage is a good one. Are there better ones? Attack speed. Planetary build speed. We would like the minerals. Minerals are better. Mineralia. Poscalico. Get the Corona again. Oh. What crazy things are happening here? Enter the orbit. Uh, where have we sent our fleet now? I don't really know. We've just disappeared, I think. I will have one of them moving back here for a for a gateway. Haven't we had um, new technology discovered? We'll need something else. Um, to another couple of science ships here. Asmol. We've completed the Gorse Cannons now. This has been terrible. The Buccaneers? Yeah, we should take that back. That back. Just sitting here as we should. Master's teachings have been expended. Hmm. Do we need that? We'll we'll see next month how how hard it is if we if we do need that or not. It's not that new technology discovered. That bad to have, I think. Food, yeah, we also need more food, as you can see, and we'll take that. We'll take it. Friends are building gateways, as they should. We also should build gateways, but also this. Mm -hmm. Powder cakes repaired. Acid acquired. Includes acquiring assets, okay. Why do we need assets? Now, we need assets to support more operations. So it's kind of ironic that we just use operations now to acquire assets, right? Repeal, no, we don't want to repeal that. Repeal minor economic sanctions, of, if you want that. Yeah, 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 and now. You have got no orders anymore. No, well, you can join here. There's also a constructor here. We'll quickly send to Arrakis. Ship is getting in. Yeah, we need to... We need to reinforce our fleet. And we're also restructuring it while doing that. Whoa, naval capacity. <laughs> Voidborn Mary died at what 218. How is that even possible? 
task ended. Ah, uh, we have this guy. I don't really know. Oh look, yeah, yeah, Plundering Lawrence. Finally, some some more good ones. Starfire in Jack. Yeah, that's a good one. Husk Cornea, also kind of good. A couple of them we need to throw out. They they won't help us in the long run. But the rest of them is okay. POS is Who's gonna get in there? Yo. And Procyon. Procyon Habitat. We have a fleet in the Urum system. I think most of the stuff has run out now, yes, so we cannot analyze that anymore. Which is kind of a shame, but also kind of okay. Culture, food, yeah. There is a planet here that we need to settle on. It's called Rel Raid and it's a Zen world. Vast ripples appear in the regolith here. Whatever their origin, they exude a calming influence, happiness, and upkeep from drones goes down. That's gonna be interesting. Wanna have someone good here. Maybe the What's that? The desert world? Strong Benathi could, could do it. Here we go. Before we colonize. Mm. We could go for one more space station. The question is where? And the question is why? We're just gonna leave it for now. New technology discovered. It probably would be good to make some stations at, for example, the wormhole or something like that, as we don't control the wormhole really. Yeah. Let's let's do one with the wormhole. New energy credits, nice. More, yeah, more. It's still going very nicely. What's going on here? The Brink station getting down. Just as we wanted it. There's that system. Maybe we can jump in there. I don't, I'm not completely sure. We should have some more fleets here now. We'll assign one of the new scientists and he can uh, research that. After he's done that, we'll go and send him to the crime world. I think it's one of the Awoken workers that's working hard on that. Mm, we're kind of we're we're retaking the economy now. That's our path. Step by step, eh? Armor Alveo station. Oh look, an ice mining station. Yeah, why not? Yeah, that's also something we'll start. The ice mining stations. We'll start again. But all, all needs to be done step by step. In a very good spot now. Growing the food right. Scanned. Thinking about that, I think we'll stop that again. I think we'll set more on economy even, so we'll go for Areopagus. Areopagus station. Uh, Zarek station. So we can have the transit hubs, because the transit hubs are also direly needed everywhere. So let's just concentrate on the inhabited systems and transit hubs. And step by step we'll connect everything and have transit hubs everywhere, which will be economy succession power, if you want so. 
you can see the economy is strong, but we need to um, we need to help out everywhere. We need to new connect technology more. technology discovered. At the bases and also at the new stations. Uh, Iraq is A needs it has a research station. No, which is good. And we get food. Let's see what more we can get. Yeah, leader lifespan is still a good choice. Here. Let's see if we can have something in the other systems as well. It would be kind of great to be able to connect this too. We'll see if that will be one day possible. This re um, first, we also need. I think we're going to start that right now. And here, we need a gateway. We'll have that in pewter. And we can start another gateway already and maybe in the in the sun system or something like that. We'll see how that goes. Mm. Yeah, we've already positioned for that thing. So we'll have access there. It's extremely important too. Debris scanned. Because it also takes a long time. Look at that. Now we have got dark matter. Access to the dark matter stuff. <laughs> dark matter propulsion deflectors power. That's that's gonna be great. And we'll get more from this system here in the future as well. Also order more battleships, I guess. <laughs> we'll see. Grand Fleet has uh, run out. Yeah, we we need to keep that. We'll see how we can do it. Construct a ship here. New technology discovered. And we should also start the gateway here because it's just a very good connector. Oh, hello there. <laughs> now, there's something useful here to have, you know. It's propulsion, it's dark matter thrusters. What well, the Gexelons know that already. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that explains a lot of things. Of course, yeah, they, they already had some war with them. Um, Crimson Baldassari. Getting on there. So, right next to the L gate, we'll have the, the next gateway. Clonk. There's also a thing here. Dark matter stuff. Yeah, we'll do that one day. Debris scanned. Nice. An Oggy Capus. There will be more scanning. Receiving transmission. Nice. So the Diri, they want to migrate. Want to get access to our people? Or what? They are natural engineers, quick learners, very strong, decadent, decadent. We don't need decadent people to be sure, but whatever. Mm -hmm. What is their friendship worth? I mean, it all costs us influence, and we need influence right now, so we're not going to take it. It's not going to be... What's over here? We have a fleet incoming soon. They're just moving so quick, but of course this is... Ah, alien megastructure. The Velotarians 
I feel the science nexus. Wow. We're impressed. We don't even have a science nexus. Which is terrifying. Construction terrifying. online. But unfortunately it is what it what it is. So Areopagus. What do we need here first? I would prefer the transit hub. And uh, I think the trade hub is connected. Mm. So we'll get with on with hangar base and an upgrade. Construction online. Alveo. It's finished its queue. Yeah, that's more we could where we can sink everything into. Debris scanned. Nice. More dark matter. Because dark matters. <laughs> Oh, you're now here at Silver Eduarda, okay. Okay, okay. Where is our... Ah, that's just so... Crap. Look at them, they're just roaming around like free people. Oh. We'll send these guys over here now. And that should, should deal with it, hopefully. Let's get in there. Let's get to Salandine. We'll need a long time, but eventually we'll be there. <laughs> Maybe before the end of the war. Can we take stuff back here? New technology discovered. Kinetic artillery. Okay, good. Ripper auto cannons. What? <laughs> Yeah, we're going for dark metal thrusters. We need more here too. Um, can we make more claims? I'd like Mir's system, currently unclaimed. We've claimed that. We we could claim that. Claim that. Mir's. Uh, Augie Capus. Make these claims. Here we go. You have awakened the sleeping sphinx. New technology discovered. And no one understands the sleeping sphinx. Uh, it's time for dark matter deflectors. Oh, well, the Nora has Voidcraft now as well. Very sweet. A new Voidcraft king. Or queen. Or whatever. A Marefian. It's never true um, if a Marefian is. Uh, never never really exact if a Marefian is, is female or what kind of gender. Undiscernible. What's happening there? What's happening with our friends? <laughs> Truly, what's going on there? New technology we discovered. Be able to stop this. Dark matter thrusters. That's very helpful. Now we'll get into minerals, I think, again. Yo, minerals it is. Is it going on here? Yeah, we don't really care about that. Son of Matu. It's unimportant. That's going to the Mir's system. There's a big fleet of the Morephians, though. They should take them out. What are they doing? Yeah, it's Maligo. The resilient leader of the Morephians. Flonk. 
Dark Matter Deflectors, nice. Now Dark Matter Reactors. Red Alex has learned. Has learned enough. And then there will be a lot of ship refitting. Oh, we that again. We're not fully replenished. Not yet. By Saint Pierre. I've been taking so many systems. What's going on there? Surely you have to be very careful. Just about everything. It's really a paranoia game now. Look at that. New technology it's discovered. Storming everything. Re revitalization. Yeah, that's good. Need more revitalization and food from jobs is also very welcome. Still, still. One more time and then we'll go four other things again but for now 212 percent is just a good bonus nice gaining research Step by step. What? What's, what? Ah, okay. <laughs> Things like that, eh? 17. Will soon be complete again. And then we'll see what we can do. Well, there's a big fleet. Fly over there. Take that out. Nice. <laughs> That's been it. Mm. Building cost is still on a good, a good thing. Uh, Coral Pier knows that now. Okay, good. good. Void Mary is uh, unfortunately out of this business. And look at that now. Gateway construction site ready in the sun system. It's good, it's good, it's good. Let's get this going. Go back to Mars. The blue planet. Yeah, we need to get the, the gateways ready. Otherwise everything will not work anymore. They're just... What is this, truly? And for some marauding. Maybe on Arcturus. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's fly here, then let's fly here. There's still some stuff that we could learn. Hmm, I don't know. We'll see. Establishing colony. Our colony here is getting established. In Wink Ward. Send some strong Benathi over. Proud desert people. And the pewter system. We also have something going on. What's going on here? A naval logistics officer, hydroponics bay. That is so 
so weird somehow. Let's just get a transit hub for now. Just to continue into that. Of some migration enabled. What did we lose here? Some of the smaller ships again. Doesn't really matter that much. Want to get into more battleships anyway. Can enter the orbit here. We claim Arcturus. Terminal Egress Station. Sweet. Scientist has the maniacal trait. Good, good, good. Good old Asante. Extinguished race. We need to start swimming here again. Eh? How can we defeat these guys? Settling status quo would be perfectly acceptable at the moment. The fleet. What are they doing? Oh, they're failing to take the station down. Uh, debris in zero. Okay, that debris, then you can go for this debris. And we'll return to, I don't know, zero or something. And the world about controlling this space is you need to control all the uh, shipyards mainly. Of course, the shipyards is what brings them back, right? So, but you have to be very careful not to lose too much, as you've seen here. <laughs> Moravia has like <laughs> blundered their whole fleet into one of these space stations that are just extremely, and we've seen that at our first attempt, they are extremely resilient. They're not like your normal way of resilient, they are just crazy resilient. Uh, we have a fleet here. We wanted to originally save these, but I think we have to go and uh, save our our uh, stations a little bit. So we'll move to Turay's system. And then we'll see. Incoming transmission. Oh, nice. A governor gained a trade. Oh, <laughs> substance abuser. Oh well, dealing with the pressure. The Bracherians want to get out. I mean, now with the Bracherians, I'm really thinking about it, but they are in the Great Gulf hierarchy now, so I don't know. No. No way. New technology discovered. Private his fleet has been fully repaired, and we're on the way to another place. Food from jobs, nice, nice, nice. What else could we get? Maybe some government progress would be nice, or, or things like that. Big bonus on that, small bonus on that. Don't need the interstellar assembly yet. Could use more star bases or admin capacity. We've had got a big bonus on that, so we should concentrate on that, definitely. So here, Timophona. Yeah, and why not some admin capacity? Little Baldassari. Only level 7, our top scientist. Kind of weird, right? What we also should do, or can do, or, or will do also, is uh, upgrade our fleets. The dev energy ones, they, they have been extremely good, but they now need replacement. We have so many of these, and of these. But the dev energy don't even have the plus the neutronium armor. Mm. 
let me see. Are we still researching that? No, we, we have that all the dark matter technologies. So let's get back into this. Mm. The death energy is is in all in all a good idea. Look at that. We could, at the cost of dark matter, do this. This also means that we need to build space stations everywhere at every dark matter station, so we get more dark matter. Maybe. Um, Let's have a short overlook at how many dark matter things we get. Um, we need, we get three dark matter per month. That's not much. It's not not much by an extreme. So we'll see. We could buy dark matter from time to time, and it's not in the upkeep, so we can definitely afford that. Also, go dark matter thrusters. So that's definitely very dark. Mm. That's all kind of good here. So the death energy is definitely something to keep. The energy, mm, yeah, that's something for later, maybe. Get into the, everything into dark matter. Also into dark matter sensors. <laughs> <laughs> Not really, but anti-monsters, um, yeah, they rely heavily on that too. The thing is, that's, yeah, it's not yet enough, right? This is just better. It's just better equipment and you want better ships if we could, can have better ships. So. Then let's see about the energy destroyer. It's okay. We want to keep it that, like that. We also want the dark matter deflectors. Uh, Anti monster is at this point the same. That might change. We'll just keep it there and I'll keep it upgraded as a class. Same goes for this. Anti-monster cruiser and the energy cruiser are currently the same. Distribute a little more. Because if you have it balanced, you generally have a better applicable defense. You want a calculable defense, not like losing out massively against something. If you don't know, then you go for a for a uh, for a balanced defense. What is being built of this? Now, what I what I like to see is like that. What clear all components? We don't want that. What I would like to see in, in the fleet manager, like clear everything that's being constructed at the moment. And that would be a button. Let's see. That seems to work. Fine. Energy Titan. More dark matter. Yeah, we want this regeneration. Why not? It's it's pretty good, I think. It just makes everything uh, fit very quickly again. Now, where do we have our fleet? Right here. Could upgrade the fleet, but not like here. So I'll just reinforce the fleet for now. Where could we upgrade the fleet? Could we do that here? Not really, but we could do it in Surpes. They're most likely going to move over to Surpes and upgrade that. Or they'll move to Terminal Egress Station. I don't want you there. I want you in Surpes. Might be a little longer, but it's still a bit of distribution. So we have Wickler Station. Do we have here Transit Hub, Hyperlane Registrar? That's important. Mm. Offworld trading is good here. 
I'll trade up another hunger bay. It's okay. to work with what we have right now. Okay, they are building gateways as well. As is absolutely recommended. Construction online. Pewter Starbase finished its construction. Sweet. More kinetic artillery and kinetic batteries. Think that. Everything is going well. Just hurrying for the impasse brawl and for the naval capacity. As you can see, it's it's getting a little bit better, except for the minerals. The minerals will have to like, heavily work discovered. on it. And we're doing that, as you can see. Um, hmm. So the speed uh, has been what we were missing so far. The speed. Yeah, the building speed cannot go up any further. So that's the reason. Uh, we only have a very limited selection here now. There we go. That's the Breen Arcturus. I think we're researching that, yes. Mm, there should be some reinforcements now coming in. Good. Exotic gases as fuel. We don't need that at the moment. Nanite actuators. I'm going to redo that. Scientific revolution. It's very helpful. We'll do that. Gives us 10% more research speed and one more research alternative, which is just its just a very good edict for the Unity. And um, I'm looking forward to that. And once we have our fleet here, completely again, scanned. we go to Ul Ula Flooders. Arcturus has been scanned. And we can, we can stay here for now. Plundering scoundrels are in orbit. Uh, I'm gonna fleet here. And we'll send them to. I oh, want to upgrade them, right? Here we go. Mm. The other fleet. They're moving around here, they will take on these guys. New technology discovered. Also, getting building costs down is more important than one might think. It's really a big help. Because it really keeps us stuck in some ways. So. Now we can go back to the sun system. We have built a couple of these ships. Couple of these ships, and we need people in them doing things so they can gain some experience. Plundering Lawrence. Going to Mars. And stuff far in Jack. Um, when can we get access to living metal technology? I wonder. I wonder. As you can see, we need more construction in that, even now. Where are you, science ship? Construction ship? Just a little bit more, 
the main thing, as I've already said, yeah, look in Ogigia, there's also someone missing, is getting experience into these scientists. So you have very excellent scientists later on. You can go and save money, that's also a point, but in the end, saving money is not going to save you. What's this fleet doing? I'm gonna fly in here and then confront. Ah, the Space Storm Ruggler has completely dissipated. Although some speculate that storms such as Ruggler could lead to the eventual collapse of the hyperspace network, thousands of years in the future, and our space travel seems to have returned to normal. Thankfully, we've got the jump drive, so we're not that affected by it. But Oh yeah, the 70k fleet. Another 70k fleet here. We'll take stuff back. Just quickly get in there. Someone has to do it, so we'll do it. Construction online. Story of the life in a federation. Someone has to do it, so we have to do it. Sarek Station in Areopagus. Harplane registrar helps. Ice mining station helps. The hangar. Mm. Yeah. It's an okay station right now. Not great, but okay enough. Building on everything. Science Nexus research wings are now in place. First module of the four research wings is now in place, and researchers and staff are already moving into the living quarters. The next and final step of construction will extend the wings, adding four sections of laboratories equipped to support our most dangerous research. Extensive security measures are being taken to ensure the staff's safety. We're almost there. And the research speed is also not negligible. It's pretty good, to be honest. New technology discovered. Administrative efficiency will help us out greatly. As we have not enough here. We could repeat that. Yeah. It's okay, we'll repeat that. Who will rule? Uh, Go life. Go life would be someone, but he's not that. I mean, the thing is, she has three levels more, right? That's that's also a big thing, so... It is Big Esmeralda again. Long live Big Esmeralda. Are we getting in there now? Plonk. Ah, they took it down already, okay. Well then, um... Move over here. You upgraded yet? No. Not something is happening there. Taking everything on. Making more claims. Maybe the sear system. Unclaimed, uninhabited. But it has one exotic gas. Oh, <laughs> oh well. We don't need much influence at the moment, so I mean influence for that is well invested influence. If we if we should get these, it would be very helpful. Now that has been taken. Good. How about we go to Nishmet next? in here. I know we, we wanted to wait, right, until until we had all our battleships now. Sweet. Let's model here too. Neshmet. 
Lara and the Singularity, and then we'll see. Wow, Brasherians are really suffering from the Jex invasions. The Jex are, are taking everything over somehow. Just incredible. The ultimate power, but the Ildar, and the Ildar are taking on as well. <laughs> So you're getting in there, and then you'll go back here. After all is said and done. There are more leaders. Oh! Engineers! Sun system. Science ship, husk Kumir in the Ogigia system, there's a room for you. Pop. New technology discovered. Nice defense platform, hull points, everything's nice there. We have a good bonus on strike craft, so let's go for strike craft. Yeah, late game tech is often about getting the bonuses and ignoring the stuff you don't need. Like, what do we not need? Any weapon systems that are not energy. And we'll just ignore that. Yeah, close to full again. Kandak has developed resiliency. <laughs> nice. Well done, man. Well done. Fleets enhanced. Powder cakes are 10% stronger. Now you can guard Talassa again. Fleet still ravaging here. Uh, everyone's died in the knee health system. We're getting back to it. The boisterous buccaneers. Yeah, look! Even repaired again. New technology discovered. Gravitational analysis. Even cheaper buildings. And now that, that has fallen off. And we'll go into cheapest first mode, which means shield hit points program. Crimson Baldassari here. Yeah, it's always the old people that go in the labs, into the labs. That's where they belong. Big Esmeralda too has uh, apparently gained a level. Praku made peace with Velotarians. Um, shouldn't we be able to make peace? No? Are the Mer defenders the Merefians? Okay, that makes sense then. What war goals could we have? I don't know. Construction online. But we're complete here again, so we'll invade again. Men Memosini Starbase. Good position. We're happy to have it. Private is parting us. Getting it on with that. Freaking station. Once the shields are broken through, oh, we'll have a party. Yeah, I think we've lost we've lost way less now. So it finally pays off to get rid of of the of the weaker fleets, right? Plonk. We get one more battleship going. Reinforce the fleet. Just hang out here for a bit. Claim. 
sell that food, be happy hopefully. Really getting into a good position, but it takes some time. Right? We have to recover first before we do anything else. Now, finally. Upgrade the science nexus again. I mean, we have good income, but it's not good enough. Nothing is good enough. <laughs> We're doing a lot with our unity income, I feel. Aha! Velasas, Velasas has leveled up and gained a new trait. Archaeology, nice. <laughs> How cute. New technology that. discovered. Private his party is fully repaired, nice. Let's sail to Nico. And let's make it clear that we instantly want to attack that. Administrative efficiency. Good, good, good. Starbase capacity. Will also be good, good, good. Taking everything on here. Yeah, and we really need all the influence for all the claims. And when we finally have peace, we can maybe change our stance from cooperative to belligerent because... <sighs> New technology discovered. That's also really awful. Now we can start to get back into the Bilnok Hive problem. Yay, um, where can we go to? Uh, let's maybe start here in the Great Wound system. Got some things here. Got the flak cannons. Got strike craft damage. That's what we were into. Defense platform hull points. Good. Defense platform damage. Good. And the rest is going to be ignored for now. <laughs> What's cheaper? There's nothing cheaper. We'll just get into hull points here. I feel they're about it better. What's yeah? Privateers party doing what it, what it can? <laughs> Melting down a gateway constructed. Nice, nice, nice. First operational gateway in the sun system. The device has formed a stable subspace conduit, established a successful link with the rest of the galaxy's network. Where are you, Gateway? Excellent. Yeah, you were here, of course. At the rim. Now we come back to the Fallen Empire. Incoming transmission. What's going on there? Wow, we've lost a lot here. What was that? Broke off research agreement with the Krabbies. And hello there, the Krabby has come around the corner. <laughs> we can learn nothing. We can learn nothing and share some technologies with them. Mm. The are in another federation. We don't take that lightly. I really lost some stuff, that's horrible. Really bad stuff. Is there something here? No, we, we just lost a lot. We just that's just terrible. Look at that. Okay, yeah, we lost our Titan. <laughs> mm, need to reinforce now. No way out of no way out of the dilemma. What's going on with these? Just hanging out in the pewter system. Got another gateway going. Everything gets gets forward with that. Is 
Says we come Construction here. online. Don't care. Ario Pegasus Starbase. It's doing well. Internal egress. We have another gateway. Nice. Do we need a gate or something like that here? No, no, not at the moment. Nothing here at the moment. We'll get better soon. New technology discovered. Demanding unoccupied systems. Yeah, we should get into that a little bit more. Energy credits or shield hit points. They are very good. Okay. It's quasi peace, so we'll take that on. Once we have been repaired. I'll get back onto it. Timophona again to level. There's some decisions going on here. The will of the mind must be obeyed. Oh no, not not that. No, we don't want to. <laughs> Voting is our civil duty. Yes, it is. It is. And we'll see that it leads to civil laws. Going on here again. <laughs> Some debris here. Colony founded. Sweet, in the Wake Ward system. It's a Zen world colony. And we'll try it this time with the clone vats, I think. Just want to be. Uh, to have something new going here. And um, maybe some support. I don't know. What could be the support? Mole harvesting traps. Three districts. And a terraforming into an ocean world. <laughs> Here we go. You can research that here again. Crazy as me. And other than that, yeah, we need to win this against. Uh, we have a cruiser there still. That's okay. New technology discovered. Let's get in here. I don't see further. Interstellar expansion. More star bases. We we always need star bases. It's star base time. Where would we like another star base? Aegis or Nereus system? Why not here? We have to intertwine at least our uh, inner circle here. What is going on there? Why are they coming so far into the system? It's crazy. We'll go here, 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 here. How strong is the station? Mm, it is something. The Billmog did already get the, the Galactic Wonder. Wow. Debris scanned. Debris is ready. Yeah, we're, we're still in a terrifying state because we don't want to have a war going on. That's one of the big things. We just don't want a war going on. We want to develop. 
because there's something out there that doesn't wait for anything. Something out there doesn't wait for our development. It wants our blood. I mean, everything is getting a little better, so... I'm not unhappy about it. It's just how it is. New technology discovered. Hmm, platform strikecraft damage would be pretty handy. And it's good. And it's good. Oh, it's not super good, but our oh, planetary build speed. That on the other hand would be even better. And why do I use this? Why do I get for the go for the bonus? Apart from um, it's a bonus, it is also beneficial if someone like tries to steal technologies from you. If you get all the technologies that are already there, he cannot steal them from you. And you still profit. So now if we want to take the absolute lead, it's mostly good to copy all other re technologies from the galaxy first. If we manage to do that, we'll be the science leader. But we will not have anything that no one else has. And that's not important too. <laughs> Can we just get, get them down, please? Oh. Need to unite the fleets again. We also would like better troops, but that's gonna be interesting. <laughs> Construction <laughs> online. 3k troops are not gonna be enough to take one of these stations, I believe. Uh, these planets. Let's have a look just into, I don't know, the core. Uh, there's no armies here anymore because it's so freaking bombarded. But look at these. <sighs> Impossible. But we could get, maybe get the core. Why not? Um, we'll set on to that. Edel, son of Rin. Get into the core. With three station. Nice. Um, transit hub. Uh, Nereo system needs hangar base. Upgrade. Sweet, and that's what we get. Some trade protection. <laughs> and trade connection, of course. These fleets. Then we'll get in into this and fill Mathios. Mas everything is new technology added. discovered. Applied superconductivity will help us out greatly, and now we can get into shields because they will help as well. Shields. Yeah, we're doing that quickly. Just very, very quickly, and so we also have we have also have time to repair all the time. It's just a good system that we have there. So you can solve that with bombardment or you can solve that with excellent ground troops. Still have to solve the problem of the armies against the Fallen Empire armies. And just like that. So, um, what is left to do? Left to do is getting rid of the roaming Fallen Empire fleets here. Recovering all the stations from the Bilnok Hive and then take over all the planets of the Yapati Shard and then 
we can win. So <laughs> that's the big plan of the Atlantean state. And of course, developing the economy. But we're doing that. We're doing that off the screen, by the way. So have a great time until then and happy gaming. This is Immanuel Kahn signing out. See you soon and happy gaming. And big Esmeralda for greets you and wishes you Poseidon's best pearls and snacks. Have a great time until next time. Happy gaming.